Welcome to this series of Advent readings and reflections which starts today. We hope these will help you journey through Advent towards Christmas and beyond to Epiphany. Each Wednesday, the readings are released followed by a reflection and prayer the following Sunday. Although each is only a couple of minutes long, we hope that they will help you deepen your faith and sustain your faith this winter. So let's start with the abridged readings for week one of Advent. Isaiah chapter 2 verses 1 to 5 and reading verse 4. He will judge between the nations and will settle disputes for many peoples. They will beat their swords into plowshares and their spears into pruning hooks. Nation will not take up sword against nation, nor will they train for war any more. Come, descendants of Jacob, let us walk in the light of the Lord. And Psalm 122, starting at verse 6. Pray for the peace of Jerusalem. May those who love you be secure. May there be peace within your walls and security within your citadels. For the sake of my family and friends, I will say, peace be within you. For the sake of the house of the Lord our God, I will seek your prosperity. Romans 13, verses 11 to 14. And do this, understanding the present time. The hour has already come for you to wake up from your slumber, because our salvation is nearer now than when we first believed. The night is nearly over. The day is almost here. So let us put aside the deeds of darkness and put on the armour of light. And finally, Matthew 24, verses 36 to 44, and starting at verse 42. Therefore keep watch, because you do not know on what day your Lord will come. But understand this, if the owner of the house had known at what time of night the thief was coming, he would have kept watch and would not have let his house be broken into. So you also must be ready, because the Son of Man will come at an hour you do not expect him.